Mr. Irish Derby, and away they go. Fusion begins well on the inside with Mr. Combustible going with them, and they're followed in third place by Ice Dancer. As they go a good pace through the first furlong, Pugin, the leader from Mr. Combustible, is in second, followed by Ice Dancer, Morshti in four. March King is next, and they're followed on the inside by Galileo. Behind Galileo comes uh, Cashel Bay. As they head up to complete the first quarter mile, and Pugin makes it by a length from Mr. Combustible. In third place is Ice Dancer, then the yellow colours of Morshti, Galileo. Tucked away on the inside in fifth, ahead of March King in Cashel Bay, and behind these is Pebble Island. They're followed by Exaltation and then Vinnie Rowe, Golden last but one, and bringing up the rear is Dr. Brender. Running on towards the mile pole now, Fusion continues to lead, followed in second by Mr. Combustible. They're followed in third place by Ice Dancer, Galileo, the dark blue colours, Mick Canan showing fourth, just ahead of Morshti. March King is next, followed by Cashel Bay. Exaltation is next on the inside of Pebble Island. Vinnie Rowe towards the back with Golan in 11th place and 12th and last is Dr. Brender as they start the uphill run towards the halfway stage in the Irish Derby and Pugin making it by almost two lengths to Mr. Combustible in second. In third place is Ice Dancer and behind Ice Dancer comes Galileo. Morshti is next, followed by March King on the outside. Vinnie Rowe makes a bit of headway behind these on the outside of Exaltation. Golan is beginning to improve too. They're up at the top of the hill. Pugin from Mr. Combustible Ice Dancer. Galileo well placed on the rails. Cashel Bay, the 500 to 1 chance on the outside of Morshti and March King. Golan getting a bit closer. They're running down now towards the home turn. Pugin being pushed along now by Niall McCullough. Ice Dancer on the outside of Mr. Combustible. Galileo still travelling sweetly just behind them. The crowd beginning to uh, rev up now as they swing for home with. Uh, just three furlongs to race. Pugin from Mr. Combustible. Galileo, the dark blue colours, still going easily. In fourth place is Ice Dancer. Exaltation. Golan is well back in the field. They're racing now into the last two furlongs, and here he comes. Galileo strikes for home. Pugin, Morshti in third. Mr. Combustible, Vinnie Rowe. Ice Dancer, Exaltation. But Galileo opens up to the furlong pole. It's Galileo, four, five lengths clear. In second is Morshti. In third place is Pugin. And as they race up to the line, Mick Canal is going to win his first Irish Derby. Galileo Galileo completes the big derby double. This is as good as it gets. Galileo wins it impressively. Second is Morshti. Golan late for third, just ahead of Pugin. Then exaltation, Mr. Combustible. Finney Rowe, followed in by Ice Dancer, Pebble Island, Dr. Brendler, Cashel Bay, and finally March King. So Galileo, the 11 to 4 on favourite, becomes the 14th horse to complete the Epsom Curra Derby double. And Mick Canan at the 18th attempt has won Ireland's uh, biggest flat racing class. Leo, 11 to 4 on favourite for Mick Canan and his first derby at uh, 19 attempts. Second, number eight, Morshti at 20 to 1 for Michael Jarvis and Philip Robinson. And number five, Golan finished third at 4 to 1. So Michael Stout with Kieran Fallon.